so salty is due on Saturday. Today's Thursday. And so far, she's not looking like she's going into labor yet. She's definitely got a big belly and her udder's coming in. And I test her every day, sometimes twice a day for milk and so far no milk. Usually they say once they have milk, it's within 24 hours that they're gonna go into labor. So I think we're safe for today again. <laughs> Salty's due date and so far no signs of labor, no milk, she's still eating her breakfast. So from what I can tell, no babies yet. Um, not sure if she's gonna have them today, I kind of feel like she isn't. So maybe tomorrow, but I'm gonna keep checking on her lots throughout the day and a few times in the night as well. And we'll play it by ear, see how she's acting through the rest of the day. Here's the prego mama, you can see she's chowing away on her breakfast, so clearly labor is not impending yet. I'm gonna keep checking on her throughout the day, but she's definitely not in labor yet, but she is moving around a little bit, so she seems a little restless, but I'll keep an eye on her today and see how she does. So Salty's been acting like really restless today and she started nesting. She had brought a whole bunch of sticks in here and she's just acting super agitated and not impressed with me being over here, which is unlike her because she's usually super friendly. And uh, she actually bit me, so. <laughs> I would say that we're getting near labor, actually. I didn't think that we were going to, but she's definitely showing some signs now. I was not able to check her for milk because she is not letting me get near her. So yeah, I will keep you updated. Her beer green, and I just tested her for milk, and there's milk now. So we have babies tonight. Hopefully, this little concoction we mixed up will help her calm down. All right, so I'm back out here checking on Salty, and she's uh, definitely looking like she's in labor now. So you can kind of see in her pen here this morning, she's been nesting and she's been pawing all this straw and stuff into her pen. She's got lots of straw in there, but they just tend to nest before they go into labor. So that's what she's been doing. And yeah, labor is imminent. I'm just trying to be as quiet and non-invasive as I can be, but this is salty right now. She's laying right here. Shivering is a pretty definite sign, I guess, that they're in labor. And she's not getting up. We gave her a little bit of grain earlier on with some beer in it, and she ate a little bit of it, but she didn't finish it, which is really unlike her, obviously. So the appetite is reduced as well. And I think we'll be having uh, piglets here very soon. I'm waiting for things to progress. I'm gonna go through my like labor kit that I've made for her. So I've got a whole bunch of freshly laundered towels to dry the piglets off. I've got some gloves to wear. My hands, I just wash, they're nice and clean. Um, I have some iodine that I can put on the navels and some cotton balls to apply. I have uh, some lubrication here in case I do need to go inside and take a stuck piglet out or maneuver a piglet for some reason. Um, I have some OB gloves, so some long gloves that go up to your elbows. I have some clamps in case I need to clamp a cord. Um, I'm not gonna be doing this right away, but eventually I have some iron shots for the baby pigs. Pretty important that they have lots of iron. Obviously some needles. 
and a syringe in there. Yeah, so that's what I have. And then obviously I have a heat lamp in her pen as well that I'll be turning on soon. So I now have the heat lamp on for Salty and her baby. She's pretty uncomfortable at this point. I've also uh, boarded up her little opening so she can't get out and also so that it keeps some of the heat in here. She's shivering. Um, she's not cold, she's just in labor, so any moms out there that have given birth probably know what I mean about the shivering thing. It's just part of what happens when you go into labor and pigs are no different, I guess. So, yep, yeah, that's where we're at right now. No babies yet, but she's definitely in labor and definitely getting close. So I'm keeping an eye on her. I check her every 30 minutes, but try not to bug her too much not get her too upset. She's pretty grouchy. Every time I come near her, she's growling at me. She did not like when I lifted the heat lamp up higher, but hopefully she settles down a little bit. We gave her a couple beers earlier on, so hopefully that'll help keep her settled down as well and help for some pain control and keep her milk in. Salty's had three babies so far. I went in to make supper and of course she's been harrowing by myself. My husband's at work. Luckily my grandma came to watch Stella, but we got babies! Thank <laughs> you. 